I'm sure Lumos. that foul smell is the scent of success. Try not to lose your nerve just yet. Oh boy. The rest of the tomb will be insect free. Yeah, the spiders aren't insects. Don't start. <laughs> Revelio. Confringo. Accio. Confringo. Accio. Guardian Leviosa. This room is taller than it looks. Rebellion. Chest in an inconspicuous loft. Brilliant. Looks like there's going to be a ton of stuff down here. Confringo! Revelio. Accio. Nope, that is not what I thought it was. Watch your step. I nearly slipped there. Revelio. This grass. It no longer feels. Like I've read about catacombs that underwent expansion efforts and ran into problems. Rebellion. Often cave ins. And then were abandoned. Exactly. Confirm. Okay then. This is the sort of great room I want to be buried in. Surrounded by grandeur. Grandeur and then some. Even an altar with a pile of bones. Accio. Lovely. Bones outside a sucker. Accio. There's something here by the altar. Let me also. What did you find? Oh, okay. Looks like part of a student's diary. It mentions plans to return for the relic and conjuring barricades using bones. Of course. The student's summary referenced the space beyond the great room, which means this can't be a dead end. I have the report if you want to have a look. Let's divide and conquer. You work on sorting out the bone barricades. I'll look around and see what we missed. Hold on to that diary entry. There may be more to it. It does mention something else. It says their next assignment was learning the Imperius curse. Really? Interesting. We need to focus on moving beyond this room. But let me think for a moment. I'd be interested to know what else the student discovered. Have a look. Unfortunately, there's no name on it, but I surmise if it was important enough for Slytherin to stash in his spellbook, it's worthy of further study. Do you think the pages were left here on purpose? Slytherin mentioned a student who excelled in charms and always carried a satchel stuffed full of notes. They might have been left on purpose, or the student may have simply dropped them. Of course. I'll start to search for those barricades. Brilliant. There's more to this than even I imagined. Look, bones stacked oddly on either side. 
Hmm. Leave no stone unturned. Or in this case, no bone. Revelio. We've made it this far. Clearly, we have more to do. Find a safe way across. Confront them. Lumos. Confront them. Lumos. Rickety Bone Bridge complete. Rebellion. You've done it. I knew we'd get through. I felt it in my bones. Nice. Before we trudge on further, I've just realized something. The student's diary mentions the Imperious Curse. I wouldn't be surprised if we're going to need it here. It's an unforgivable, but useful when you're outnumbered. Places the victim completely under the caster's control. So, if you'd like to learn Imperio, I can teach you. Where did you learn the Imperious Curse? I taught myself. Don't tell Ominous that I've told you. It's not exactly something I can brag about, but it may come in handy. I think you ought to know it. Shouldn't I know more about what the curse entails? Remember the Blasting Curse? Same idea. Except when it comes to unforgivable curses, your intention has to be clear. You have to mean it. It's probably wise to know the spell. I couldn't agree more. A spell that could save your life shouldn't be unforgivable. You have a lot at stake. You have an ability that evidently no one's seen for centuries. Focus your wand movement. It's not an easy spell to master. 
right, let's do this. There we go. Something troubling ahead. Be on. Another barricade. Considering how the last one, this should be a cinch. <laughs> how gracious of you. I try. That worked. Good for you. Imperial. Read the world of another spider. I shall sleep better okay, tonight. This looks different than what we faced before. Yeah, I already finished it. You are head and shoulders above these bones. Nicely done. I see Rebellion. why Slytherin's student was so entranced with this place. Holy crap, alright. Alright, what exactly does this thing do? The company forces enemies into a fight as if they were your companions. Well, under your control, to reduce damage to other enemies to prolong. Okay, also, curse it to the victim. Dead end. Lovely. All that for nothing. Hold on. Don't give up yet. Yeah, man. I ain't giving up.
Revelio. Sebastian, the relic. Look. Could it be? The note and rendition of the relic. It matches. This must be where the student left the relic. I can't believe it. After all this, it lines up. We've really found it. What do you suppose is meant by the dark sacrifice required to realize the relic's potential? I have no idea, but we're here for the relic. The note advises to leave the relic alone. I assure you, we were meant to find this. For Anne's sake, I'm taking it. Let's get to Feldcroft. I must keep this relic secret, especially from my uncle. Revelio! Is that ominous? Ominous! The sounds we kept hearing, it was you. You gave me no choice. I had to follow you. Sebastian, please, leave the relic alone. We can find another way to help Anne. I'm sorry, Ominous, but I'm taking it. No, you're not. If you won't put it back, then I will. Hold on, both of you. Sebastian, please, take a step back. Fine, but Ominous knows I won't step back from a fight. Can't believe this. How much did you hear? Everything. I was glad to hear you tell Sebastian to leave the relic. We need to stand together. Convince Sebastian this is wrong. And if nothing will change his mind? Something has to. I need your help. You're right. This seems far riskier than Sebastian realizes. Good. We're agreed. We don't allow him to leave here with the relic. I do think we should talk to him, but I fear we won't stop him from taking the relic. What are you suggesting? I'm suggesting we negotiate. We allow Sebastian to leave with the relic under one condition. After this, no more. I feel that's what we agreed to in the scriptorium. I'm being taken for a fool. You're not ominous. This may be the only way to keep your friendship intact. Let's trust him to know what's best. Fine. If I trust him on this, I'm trusting you too. The dark arts seem harmless until it's too late. <sighs> Go then. Leave with the relic. I'll not say a word more. I hope I don't regret this. Sebastian, we're ready. What is it? I haven't changed my mind. Ominous has. Let's go. What? Ominous? I'll explain on the way. Come on. Revelio. Confringo. Revelio. Confringo! Confringo! 
Trigger! Revelio. Revelio. <laughs> well, what happened back there? Ominous and I found a compromise. Ominous simply needs a moment with you and he'll change his mind. Is that it? I told him we ought to give you this chance, that the relic is too important to ignore. There has to be more to it than that. Tell Rebellion. me. Rebellion. We agreed on what was needed, Sebastian. You have my word. As we were leaving, Ominous wouldn't even acknowledge me. That's not like him. He was troubled, Sebastian. Even though we agreed to it all, it's been a lot to take in. I thought he understood. He knew we couldn't give up. All of this is too important. For Anne. Happened here. When we get to Feldcroft, I'd rather Anne not know what had to be done to get this relic. She thinks like ominous. It did only upset her. Joe, do you see all this? Your whole hometown is smoking. Oh no, this isn't good. What is it? Smoke! Over there, by the hamlet. Oh shoot. Feldcroft's in trouble. They're under attack. Let's hurry. <laughs> Yo, what's going on here?
Sister. With an unforgivable curse. From that damned book, no doubt. Your father would be ashamed. You've gone too far, Sebastian. Stay away from her. From all of us. <laughs> what did my uncle expect me to do? The Imperious Curse saved Anne's life. That goblin was going to kill her. You did what you had to do. If I have to keep proving that to my uncle, I will. He cannot banish me from my own home, from my sister. It might be best to let him calm down a while. May I speak to him? Perhaps I can help to ease the tension a bit. You may be right. Very well. Probably best if I get away from here for a while. I'll head back to Hogwarts. What was he thinking? Pardon me, Mr. Sallow. What Sebastian did was inexcusable. You cannot possibly be about to defend him. Uh... <laughs> uh... Sebastian and I have encountered Ranrock's loyalists before. That goblin would have killed Anne. This family does not resort to using dark magic even against our enemies. What Sebastian did cannot be undone. That you are defending Sebastian's behavior at all tells me everything I need to know. You are as guilty as he is. Sebastian is to come nowhere near Feldcroft, nowhere near Anne. Unforgivable curses are so named for a reason. If I hear that either of you continues down this path, if either of you uses dark magic, I will notify the headmaster immediately. Wow. Why, Sebastian? Well, you know what? You know what? Never mind. All right, then. Well, that's the end of this. It's a little on um, me getting this in. I totally forgot about that. I, I don't know the name of it. But, um, yeah, we got another dark dark spell so hope you guys are gonna like this video like comment subscribe do all that kind of stuff see you got my next video peace out
the room. You're not so bad, chap. For a Slytherin. For a Ravenclaw, you certainly have a lot to learn. Dang. Ranrock's loyalists never knew to look for it. Revelio. Can't pick that up. Okay. Okay, I was wondering, like, is there a way for me to get up there? Can bring up. Wingardium Leviosa. Sebastian, I think I found something. A canvas piece. Brilliant. Our efforts weren't in vain after all. Still, something about this place feels odd. What do you have there? A journal entry by Isadora. Hopefully it will help us unravel more of this mystery. That's everything here. If the triptych led us here to find this bit of canvas, we can probably assume that Isadora Morganark was here. She seems to have been everywhere. But if she was using the Undercroft, and the cellar beneath her manor in Feldcroft, why would she create this space? And why hide it behind cryptic rune symbols? And ancient magic that no one but you could see? Isadora and Percival Rackham, another of the Keepers, could see traces of ancient magic too. Rackham? I haven't heard his name before. His are some of the memories I've seen. I don't think he and Isadora saw eye to eye on how this magic should be used. Well, this is all rather baffling. Let's take the canvas back to the triptych. Perhaps the answers are there. This place is odd, to be sure. But I'm fascinated by Revelio. it. Revelio! Now, for the trek back out of here and to Hogwarts. Unless we can find another passageway to the Undercroft? Let's have a look around. Right here. And now for the moment of truth. It has to fit. Please tell me you recognize the location in this bit of canvas. The good news is I do, in fact. Oh. And the bad news? We're in for more trouble. Oh, man. I know that coast. Ranrock has taken over a huge mine in the surrounding area. Mara and Weem has suffered for it. It's as bad as Feldcroft's become. Should we head there now? We should wait. Why? 
All this time, we've been a step behind, Ranrock. I may know someone who could help us get ahead. Who is that? Someone who knows Ranrock personally. They asked me not to mention their name to anyone. A goblin? Tell me I'm wrong. You know goblins cursed my sister to shut her up. Said she should be seen and not heard. I do, but not all goblins are... Not all goblins what? Have you forgotten, Feldcroft? Have you forgotten the mine we just went through? No, Sebastian, I haven't. You're not listening to me. Why would I listen to someone so ignorant? You don't know what you're saying. Take a breath for a moment. Oh, I know precisely what I'm saying. Unbelievable. Dang, man. Sebastian, why you gotta do me like that? Then I gotta go and talk to him for a mission. I still haven't done, but yeah. Well, shoot. All right, guys, I'm gonna wrap this one up. I uh, hope you guys are gonna like this video, like, comment, subscribe, do all that kind of stuff. And by the time the next video comes out, we will go to Ad Admin? Ad Admin? I think they have the name. But yeah, we're going to back to that goblin that we helped. But yeah. See you guys next time. Peace.